I think you were on here, Scotty, when Nas said, uh, instead of charging $70 for games, maybe have like a, a donation type uh, m model, oh, yeah. oh, right? Where yeah. you can donate money if you really mm -hmm. like a game. Um, no, however, no, no, I didn't say that. Oh, I didn't say that. That was Mikey Barra. I saw his, re I saw the reaction to him. I'm not taking credit for that anymore. No, 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 no. We said that. We said this. We said, once you say it, everyone's going to start saying it. They must have seen this, this podcast box and was like, you know what? We're just going to take it. So it's all right. To be fair, I wasn't talking about doing that for AAA games. Right. No, no yeah, yeah. freaking way. Yeah, you pay 70 bucks for a game. That's more than enough. They took your ideas, put, put a little spin on it. Right. Oh, yeah, AAA games. yeah. Now, that's the thing, though. Like, I think the the 70 dollars price tag is already a full price game right mm. but if it was like 30 bucks 40 bucks and it was a triple a game i wouldn't mind donating money to them I'd be like you know what i love this thing here's 10 bucks you know or here's 15. and you know that you're gonna have people out there that's like here's 100 <laughs> you know and that will equal out to a really decent um uh would it return on that game right so yeah, that seventy dollar price tag. He was he was uh, out of order with that. But the fundamentals, yes, I agree with. You know what I mean? Fundamentally, yeah, I, I, I think, agree with him. I think people were going after him more because of him being uh, <laughs> being a higher up at Activision Blizzard for a long time, and then yeah. the all of the layoffs, and they're putting it all on his feet. Yeah, yeah. And you know what? You can you can separate him and what he's what you perceive him to be responsible for mm -hmm. from the idea that he has and you can treat yep. them as two different things you don't automatically have to shit on a good <laughs> potentially good idea just because you don't like the person saying it yeah yeah does, does that therefore mean that he can never say anything that you might agree with because of what his past is that's kind of stupid uh, yeah i 100 percent agree with that wow I, I would even go as far as to say that uh if the president of embracer had a good idea it, it would be okay with me uh -huh. <laughs> um i what is i can't even remember his name right now but yeah if he came out and said something like this minus the seven dollar game i'm like you know i really don't like this guy but he's right <laughs> he's right on that he's on a line but he's right it's yeah. that that's that meme from uh winter soldier and uh what is it uh anthony mackey yeah 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 yeah. It's so, hard though. Sometimes I get I get the temptation. It's like, oh, somebody I don't like is saying something. I'm gonna mm -hmm. try and find a, a a crack in here, something I could dunk on him with. <laughs> yeah, right? I get it. But mm -hmm. Chill out. Yeah, give the man his due. He's 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 onto something pretty good there. A broken clock can be right twice a day. That is true. Yes, and he's right on this. Uh, you no, know I think like I think I think the idea is there, mm. but you can see why people get really pissed off about it. Mm -hmm. is that the games now aren't that great so people are looking at it mm -hmm. thinking hold on we've got next generation consoles out the games aren't up to standards mm -hmm. yet you want us to give you more money when games are already 70 dollars 70 pounds like yep you know that's that's gonna that's gonna get on people's nerves oh yeah yeah and i, I totally get where they're coming from too if if he would have just put the base line at around 40 uh 30 40 bucks i think he would have been yeah totally fine but he uh he took it to the extreme he's like hey hey fellow gamers while you're paying for this uh <laughs> this 70 dollar you know full price game how about throwing a little extra you know for your witcher there you know but we're gonna for charge you for the dlc later on <laughs> <laughs> yeah for witcher 3 i think i i, I might have considered it i might depend you know what a lot of it comes down to how much mm -hmm. i paid for the game in the first place oh, wow. If I paid seven, if I paid full pop for it, then no, I'm probably not going to tip. I'm going to look at this and say, I've already spent enough on this. Right on. Yeah. And I think that's where a lot of people are <clears throat> with it right but now. But if you buy a game, if you buy like a game that's on sale for 20 bucks and you feel like you get more out of it than what you spent, if you feel compelled afterwards to spend more money on it without being asked, absolutely. You should be able to do it. Yeah. If, if what people think about Yabara this is it's a good idea it's a good idea okay not for triple a not for triple a well AAA. I, again i will say triple a is fine as long as they price it right 